Our next award winner is Michael Garl, age 18, coming to us from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. Hey, Michael. <laughs> So cool, so cool. <laughs> Help you. <laughs> Just so the last line is Michael intends to be a, a professional sportscaster. Um, so, you know, this is like, uh, you know, he's reviewing my script and I'm very nervous. Uh, okay, so how are we doing so far there, bud? How are we doing? Oh, start here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Even though Michael has had some challenges um, with, with his physical limitations, um, and even though he has used hearing aids and assistive learning devices, he never misses the opportunity to get as much information as he can and to be involved in all of his classroom academics. At one point, doctors had predicted that he may never walk. Well, <laughs> we've disproven that. However, the doctors didn't account for Michael's drive and determination. Michael attended a German bilingual program from kindergarten through high school where he consistently made the honor roll with a course load that uh, pre-calculus, biology, and application software. He always made sure he received appropriate accommodations. He made sure he received appropriate accommodations, including the use of a computerized note taker. But all of his success has really been due to his dedication, his hard work. Sarah Paul, Michael's former teacher, says this about Michael. He has never asked, why me? He continues to work hard to overcome any barrier that may be in his way, even if that means putting in more time on schoolwork, more than his peers. And teacher Tony Caballo, Michael is exceedingly positive and is prepared to tackle anything. His willingness to participate is always present and he continually exceeds all expectations. Incredibly, Michael has learned to walk on his own and even has tried out for his high school sled hockey team. He is now pursuing a four-year degree from the University of Winnipeg and hopes to eventually become a radio broadcaster for the National Hockey League. Congratulations. You. You're going to do it. 